Hello everyone, so check this out. We come in here, we delete everything, we add ourselves a circle, and then we can kind of play around with the parameters, make it look uh, however we want, and go in here, extrude this puppy up uh, a bunch, uh, move up, whoops, move up, yeah, there, like so, and then add ourselves a bunch of loop cuts, select the top here, turn on proportional editing, start spinning this sucker around 180 degrees, whoops, 180 degrees, and then uh, use uh, our mouse wheel to mess around with the influence here. And we just want to we just want to spin it just enough so the bottom ring doesn't twist at all, so that the top and bottom line up. And then uh, come over here to the modifiers tab, and then do a simple deform bend 360 degrees like so. And if you don't like how that looks. Uh, then we can press uh, Shift S, and then kind of play around with uh, how the thickness of it until it looks just the way you like. So that is pretty nifty. So uh, take a look at this. We can get create this really cool effect here by um, turning turning that off, uh, rotating on the Z axis. So uh, yeah, historically there's been like no way to do this. Uh, <laughs> And not not any way that I know. Maybe maybe with twist, you know. Actually, I'm gonna check that out really quick. I want to see if uh, twisting is a thing that we can do. Simple deform. Kind of curious. I'm just kind of curious if twist can do it. Yeah, I don't know because that looks weird. Restrictions. Let me look at this. Is does this work? because I want to show off something that I, I really, yeah, think is interesting. So this is Babby's first uh, geometry nodes implementation. So we just come in here, make sure that geometry nodes is on top. Add ourselves a nice little transform node. And now we can kind of uh, rotate this around on the Z axis using geometry nodes. Now. This is really nice. So we do the uh, the all too famous um, hashtag frame command to create a nice little driver, and then uh, play the animation. And now we got that thing going. And uh, prior prior to geometry nodes, I didn't know any way to possibly do this. That is pretty freaking neato.